The engines on the island of Sodor want to be responsible, reliable, and really useful. They are happiest when Sir Topham Hatt gives them important work to do. James thinks his work is very important indeed. He is proud of his shiny red paint and likes to look clean and smart. One day, Percy puffed to the washdown. My whistle's clogged. He tried to blow hard to clean it out, but instead blew mud all over Gordon. Silly, huffed Gordon. Percy was trying not to laugh. Keep your dirt away from me. I'm collecting the mayor today. I should do that. Really, chuckled James. You'd need a washdown first. Pah, snorted Gordon. James just laughed. Soon, James had collected the mare and puffed proudly away. Just look at me, Gordon! Show off, grunted Gordon. Sir Topham Hatt came to the sheds. I need an engine to collect the Queen of Sodor. Who's the Queen of Sodor? A leaky old barge, replied Sir Topham Hatt. She needs to go to the workshops. It's dirty work, I'm afraid. Just then, James shunted into the sheds. This gave Gordon an idea. Is collecting the Queen of Sodor important work, too? Very important work. Do I have a volunteer? Very important work, exclaimed James. I'll do it. Then it's settled. She's waiting at the canal. Thank you, sir, said James. Gordon was delighted his plan was working. I'm here to collect the Queen of Sodor, announced James. There she is, the odd manager said. James was furious. That slimy old tub? Gordon tricked me. He wants me to get dirty. I'll show him. A shiny engine like me never gets dirty. Soon, James set off with the Queen of Sodor. It was a long journey to the workshops. Shiny and clean, shiny and clean, puffed James. Then there was trouble. The tall funnel of the old barge crashed through a pipe. James was sure he'd get covered in sludge. But he didn't. Shiny and clean, shiny and clean, he declared again. The workmen soon cleared the mess, and then James was on his way. He arrived safe and sound, and pleased that the dirty work was done. When James returned to the sheds, he was very proud of himself. How did you manage to stay so clean? I have to stay clean, boasted James, in case there's important work to do. Just then, Percy returned from the quarry. My whistle is clogged again. Watch out, James! Dust went everywhere. I did warn you. You'll need a washdown now, teased Thomas. Good, snorted James. It will make me readier than ever. I'm such a splendid engine. Oh, oh, oh.